a dream I know Deep up my feelings for you Hello reality viewers, welcome back again to Reality Latest Gist, the home of news and politics. For this channel, we they drop news every day and we they react to every video when it comes our way. And our reality news now we they drop for this channel and we they also they talk on as it be. If today now the first time we say they come across this channel, you are highly welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are returning subscribers, I appreciate all of you now for our massive support to this channel i say may god bless all of you now in jesus name amen i get video away i want to present to una this very moment and i'm going to follow now they watch the video after we don't watch them together make we drop our opinion constructively for the comment section like our videos and also share our videos if possible bye for now all of you remember when uh, bubago in Imo state killed 14 innocent youth these people that are shouting oh oh People are dying, you know, in sit at home. You other sit at home. Did you see any of them condemning the 14 young boys that were murdered in their cold blood be coming, uh, coming back from wedding? Coming back from wedding, from their friend wedding, they were all murdered in their cold blood. 14 of them. Did you hear any of these people shouting, sit at home today? You know, did you see them condemning the, the death of those 14 young men? You didn't see them because what you hear, what you see them doing now in the from the people they killed in the city at home is politically motivated. It is because of P2B and we have defeated them. So if the P2B is not in the picture, nobody will talk. It was us, us, it was on this particular platform that we ordered Biafrans to sit at home for three good days. To protest the killing of the four young men, Biafrans, in Imo State. That three days sit at home also has to do with during the time Mazinam Dikano went to court and Monday sit at home and another one day. It was three days and Biafrans responded and there were 100% compliance to that three days sit at home. The records are there. Did you hear Oga Ohaneze? calling for um, arrest of the people that killed innocent 14, innocent Biafrans in Imo State. Young men, young boys that went to wedding. Did you hear Haneze condemn them? Did you hear Haneze call for the arrest? Did you hear anybody making writing petition anywhere online that, oh, you this killing cannot be accepted. Why would you kill innocent boys? 14 of them. 14 of them were murdered in their cold blood. Nobody, nobody. In fact, that reminds me, I am going to play one of the women. Confirm black smoke. Eh, she? Hey! Jesus! Jesus! When I call from, okay, I'm going to call and call from. Let me call my cash. This was how the Nigeria military bombed the market in Imo State. This is not sit at home. This was not a sit at home. Nigeria military went to our community and started burning them. They have been burning it. Nobody has issued statement. Nobody anywhere. Our market were being burnt. Uh, people were being killed. Nobody has condemned it. Not Ohaneze. Not nobody. Because they never care for you. Today, they are pretending, uh, shouting, oh, you know, sit at home. Uh, people were killed. All of a sudden, they care. It is called politically motivated blackmail. They could not stand up, uh, you know, to protect and defend the people they claim they love. So ask them, where were they? When Imo State, when market in Biafra land were being raised by the Nigerian military? Or is a, is a ESN company in the market? So let me bring the picture, the another um, image of a woman. We, after the killing of these 14 young men, what did we do? We ordered sit at home. 
to protest against their killing. But all the people that are shouting today, all the people that are making all this noise is because of P2B. They never cared for you. They never, you know, they never want you to be alive. They never want anything good for you. It is all about P2B and we have defeated them. So we are going to now play the killing of young men in Imo State. I did not know that I'm going to talk about this today. So hopefully I'll find the hopefully I'll find the, the video. Okay, let, uh, let us watch this. Ah, yes. I am junior brother can Then after I and they go back to speed the papa. The new moon to one machine and I dive how bar haka for our papa. Bahani the machine and not a harbor, Bahani the town. Then Okada was the my brother from a revised out with his speed. As may have a urban dog out of fear or buffer because all the all those are the straight road. My mama got that straight road and I went behind the truck, block all the road. Then I have a good day, go and convert. The other person nominals. And then I have a point of Hannah, Bahana Jubilus, now trying out what I buy. Then one very time without my brother, man. Only a canon as other. Here we have a Bawood boy. Then are you hearing? Nobody, none of these Igbo people talking today condemned or even make any move to challenge the people that killed this young man. But who did? We did. Simon Nepa ordered. On behalf of the Biafra people, three days sit at home for this particular crime against humanity committed in Imo State. Numerous of them, Biafrans complied. It is on record. But today, you don't hear anybody talking about it. Okay. So, then that my brother, So, Habaji <laughs> Mozambique. The Yes. No one minute can have a punish from the other people in our bank. So, voice of fool, actually, don't shoot this boy. Boku, don't shoot. Don't. Did you hear that? When this incident happened, Simon Epa sat on this chair and ordered sit at home because of the pain I feel. The way they are murdering their friends. Ohaneze did not talk. Elders Council or whatever did not talk. All the people raising petition and writing, they did not come out. And this is just one in the hundred of them, how our people are being butchered every day. That is why we are fighting, putting our life online to save our people. And somebody will come and say, Simonetta ordered this, go and kill them. You people are idiots.